in a time of chaos with fuel shortages, COVID, fuel shortages, toilet paper shortages, food shortages, just shortages in general. Two men would resist the tide of despair and bring joy to millions. Charlie de Havilland is Captain Rambunctious and Figglesworth is Figglesworth. Are you alright? Yeah. <laughs> Oh no, we'll have to get a cup, cup of tea. <laughs> penis! Great big penis! <laughs> that reminds me, I was debugging champion of 1993. Right, well, good morning, Tally Valley Ho. Welcome, first ride of Rambunctious and Bigglesworth, because he finally has a new motorbike. Huzzah! Finally. Yes, indeed, finally, fuck's sake. Um, and we've decided to uh, bless it with uh, the Chalbury TT, which is actually one of the first things we ever did uh, as a video on YouTube. The Chalbury TT was when we just had cameras mounted on our bikes. Yes, we didn't have any intercoms, did we? Forgot about that, forgot about those days. Oh, horse. Horses, yep, I see. It's coasting now. <laughs> oh, it's it's going. Anyway, enough of that. Right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so yes, Bigglesworth has a new motorcycle. Woohoo! What is it? What is it? What is it? It is a Triumph Thruxton RS. RS? What does it's that an mean? RS. I was very tempted by a Speed Twin. I was very tempted by a Scrambler 1200. But ultimately, when I saw this one in resplendent in gloss black, Ooh. I just fell in love and um, Destination Triumph did me a good deal and everything was good. Very nice. I like, I like, I like, I must admit, I do like the fairing on the black one. <laughs> and you've adorned it with gold shiny bits too, like I have with Merlin. I do. There are a couple of little shiny bits. And uh, yes, well, we're going to be doing a walk around, I think. So uh, may as well put that in here. Here is the walk around. <laughs> these oh they're the tech brakes aren't they yeah 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 they're quite good they look quite nice those they're really good i'm very pleased with them did you fit them yourself uh, no 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 no. i got the i got the people who know what they're doing to do it i'm not allowed triumph has said i'm not allowed to touch my motorbikes anymore because i end up making things worse <laughs> <laughs> right anyway here we go here is isolde who is um there's an old-fashioned weird fairy tale called tristan and isolde uh, he was a Cornish king and she was a mermaid or something crazy like that. Anyway, he probably fucked her originally. It was a pre-Arthurian tale. Um, and uh, I think Wagner wrote a yes. opera about that. Anyway, here we go. Here is is old. Um, it's not old, actually. It's new. Um, so this is a Triumph Fraction RS. Uh, 105 brake horsepower, I believe. Around about that, yeah. And about 78 to 80 foot-pounds of torque. I, I, I think. Uh, it is the high power engine, hence Bonneville 1200 HP. I've done a walk around about this. Oh, look, he's got the uh, he's got the lock in here, which kind of ruins the look of the engine. But, you know, who cares? You know, safety, practicalities, safety and security. It's black. Oh, it's got it's got M50 calipers now. It now has M50 calipers. <laughs> I can't tell the difference. <laughs> uh, anyway, so he has adorned it with this because he is Bigglesworth. Black and gold is always a winner. Can't you tell? <laughs> right. Um, uh, he's been copying me, basically. But there we go. <sighs> Obviously, he has the tail tidy. Uh, he got that sticker from me. Vance uh, and Hines. <laughs> Don't forget uh, the He's got the Vance and Hines brushed slip-ons. Very nice. Very nice. Upswept, um, which means that they can fill up with water when it rains really heavily. <laughs> oh, and he's got the um, panniers. Uh, is it the SW Motec? Uh, panniers, so the, a little rod goes in here, clips into here, and you press that bit there back in to slide it out again, and then that clip clips on it, and it doesn't really rub against the forks either. So he's got those two. Rossa Corsa tyres? Uh, no, then Metzeler, Metzeler RRs. Oh, Metzeler RRs, RRs. They're actually slicker than the Rossa Corsa ones, looking at yes. them. Um, do they warm up? easily because i think they're really good tires they're better than the cool. pirellis because i because i i found the pirellis took a lot longer to warm up 
but yeah, it's lovely. It's a beautiful Thraxton. He's got these sort of leatherette uh, knee pad tank pads, which are lovely. They're quilted. Just needs the matching quilted seat, really. Um, he has the same SW Motec magnetic tank bag as I've got, which is lovely. And yeah, the only thing missing really is cruise control. I've got the Motone, Motone engine covers. Oh yes, the Motone engine Union flags, Union Jack flags. Very nice. You've got the standard oil filler cap, so that needs to change, doesn't it? <laughs> and these nice Triumph shiny ones. Very nice. Very nice. And and of course, stripey gold. Yes, and and he put on some go faster stripes. I it's think they look really good. I got to admit. We just basically just added laminar drag, but there we go. That's all right. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, there he is in his resplendent in his Oxford jacket, and he's incredibly pleased about his new bike. And yes, really, oh, don't walk backwards, Bigglesworth. You're about to get run over. Um, quite strangely, this is our first ride out together this year because he didn't have a bike. Anyway, Mer Merlin-wise, I've done a few of these pictures on um, uh, Instagram. Uh, I've Obviously got the uh, Motone Customs solid brass Monza cap, and I've I've been adorning mine with various bits of gold as well. It's the way forward. <laughs> um, but yeah, all is well. So off we go then. Tally valley ho. <laughs> oh, they sound good together. And I love it. She's gorgeous. She's gorgeous, she is. Right. There's a car calling out on the left, by the way. Right out, good spot. I'm not sure whether you. <laughs> Here we go. Woohoo! And is it me or is it spitting with rain? Um, yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, never mind. <laughs> yeah, never mind. As long as the road's dry. <laughs> How much fun is this? Uh, I don't know this road at all. Unless you want to mate with a stone wall, it's it's quite a slow left here. <laughs> yeah. oh. You've missed my lunacy, haven't you? Oh, hello! Nice green MGB convertible there. <laughs> oh, hooray! We're back. Terrorising Oxfordshire. Yes. We should have recorded a trailer or something. Charlie de Havilland is Captain Rambunctious. And Bigglesworth is Bigglesworth. Are you alright? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, this that's a good view, isn't it? Look at that. Where's this bloody rain come from? No one, no one around, is there? <laughs> okay, hang on. In unison, ready? All right. What? Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, we're so childish. <laughs> Well, tally bally ho, off we go again. So we've had a bit of a, a walk around hiatus where it's just been sort of spitting on us a little bit, which is nice, it helps to clean the bikes. You all right? Yeah. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. See, the thing is, now there's droplets of water on my clock. I can't see what speed I'm doing, Your Honour. <laughs> oh yeah, the road is wet now. It wasn't just now. Oh, well, never mind. Well, big bump. Oh, shit. <laughs> Well, the weather, ladies and gentlemen, was meant to be uh, dry today and sunny. So, not really sure where this came from. And those car drivers were all using their windscreen wipers, which doesn't bode well. 
Okay, we might have to curtail this and find a cafe. <laughs> oh no, we'll have to get a cup, cup of tea. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to stop and have some food. Shit. Oh man. So should we avoid any cattle grids? <laughs> yeah, grid warfare of doom. That really was one of those, oh my god moments. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, I'd rather not. Bam 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 Okay, we're a bit out, out of sync there. <laughs> My fault. It is a very, very pleasant part of the country. It is. The Chalbury TT. Basically, Chalbury up to Chipping Norton, then down this road towards Burford. But we don't get that far. We turn left after a good bit of fast road, really. Shipton under Witchwood. There are some cool names around here. <laughs> Definitely somewhere you don't want to get stuck. Or you'll get killed it by a cult of witches. <laughs> They'd just worship my cock. What? <laughs> Who, who's going to do this, sorry? <laughs> the witches of Shipton under They're Witchwood, witches. obviously. Oh, to be fair, they, they'll probably try and extract your semen. That's what witches do. That is what they do. So, yes, I think we should stop. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Definitely a place we should <laughs> Oh, that's sharper than I was expecting. Oh, yeah. Is this going to be another really stupidly sharp one? <laughs> oh, no, that's not too bad. That's it, this is the uh, Charbury TT, the last leg. So that's that leg, this is this leg. It's surprisingly short, actually. It is, it's about 23 miles or so. Well, he was racing me, wasn't he? <laughs> penis, great big penis. <laughs> He really didn't want to be overtaken, did he? <laughs> Way! Crossroads, just be wary. Just be wary on the crossroads. Yes. And it is still quite wet under under rubber. I was going to say wet underfoot, but it's not. It's rubber. There's quite a yeah. It's as if it's there's little sections which are getting rained on, but not all of it. <laughs> what a road though! It really is, I'm loving this. I mean, it's basically, we could do a day where we just go round and round and round. <laughs> just get faster and faster. <laughs> well that's the point, isn't it? You need to know it. I just love the way it just dips, it's got lovely little dips on and crests and it's... Yeah, it's a beautiful countryside as well. Car! No, <laughs> I was going to... They, they <laughs> saw and slowed down. Thank yeah. you. There's a bit along here which always catches me out, but it's not this bit. Oh, I'd compress! Oh! <laughs> Your stomach goes a bit funny around that one. <laughs> Jesus, more junctions, careful. Just don't get, just don't get caught up with bit you think you get caught up by. <laughs> to be honest, it's tradition. 
I always get caught out on it, so I'd be a bit upset if I wasn't. I'd think, I'd, I'd think there was something wrong if I didn't get caught out on it. Do you reckon it might be over this crest? Oh. No? <laughs> where, where does the road go? <laughs> hey! That's <laughs> oh, just hilarious, I love it. <laughs> oh dear. I love our playground, you know. Yeah. Right, it's clear. Clear, clear, the corner. clear. Clear, still clear, sir. Still clear. Yep, still clear. This right turn is always is a lot sharper than I'm expecting. Uh, right, so you prepared for it today? Because I remember the trees, you see. Oh, fuck. There we go. Oh, look at that. Beautifully done. Well done, Concord. I mean, Merlin. Whoa, fuck. Oh, bumpy. <laughs> <laughs> in interesting road surface. Right, I'm not going to make it around there. Still clear. 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 Clear over the crest. Clear. clear. Yep. Clear. All clear, sir. Thank you. Bump. Whee! Pump. <laughs> Are you all right? Yeah, just enjoying the little humps and <laughs> some lovely lady lumps. Uh... This 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 sort of mizzle is a bit annoying, but. It's not too bad, at least. Then we go zooming down the hill. Obviously, when there's a junction here as well, so you kind of have to be careful. And here we are, back in Charlbury. 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 There we go. That was the Charlbury TT yet again. <laughs> Even though the sky's blue, there's still water coming from somewhere. <laughs> Head down. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Definitely near there. Elbow. It's it's like you're in the TT. It's <laughs> <laughs> Blue skies, dear boy. Blue skies. Right. Here we go. Stop. Oh, hang on. <laughs> right, right. You ready? What are we, do what are we Not doing? behind us. Hang on, let's get level. Ready? Right. So it'll be three, two, one, go. All right? Okay. Three, two, one, go. Oh, fuck! <laughs> <laughs> Stop! <laughs> um, <laughs> I pulled a wheelie. <laughs> <laughs> I, um... I pulled a wheelie and shat myself and rolled off. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> a small wheelie as well, but thankfully this was probably a bit more manageable. <laughs> I um, yes, that was um, uh, that was interesting. That was interesting. <laughs> I think I think I might need to practice. We're, we'd be uh, we'd be rubbish at Santa Pod, wouldn't we? <laughs> oh. Completely useless test. <laughs> all it all it all it proved was our complete incompetence. <laughs> that, that was definitely my fault. <laughs> oh, it's good to see you back on the Thruxton. No, it's good to be back. What you might want to do is get all the silver plastics painted black. Silver plastics? Yeah, the plastic bit that holds on the front oh. mud guard and the. The lower fork clamp and that sort of thing. <laughs> Beautiful colours. Look at the trees. Isn't it lovely? So as you talk about the beauty of the trees, there's me going, oh, sniffly nose. <laughs> yes, it is beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Trees, not my nose. <laughs> I don't know. I wouldn't say you've got a bad nose. We're out on our motorbikes in the sun and it's not too cold to ride. <laughs> You do that as well, then, the sort of occasion you're just going, Vroom. So I sometimes put it in, in a lower gear than I need to, because it just sounds good on the when I back up and go, hang on, stay still. Hello. I just love that little sound, does it? <laughs> yeah. Why are you going so slowly? Why are you going so slowly? 
Why are you going so slowly? It's 50, not 40, you wankers. It's 50, not 40, you wanker! Oh no, don't, no, no, the line. The line of doom. The line of doom is changing its size. <laughs> the line of doom can fuck myself. Oh, shit balls. <laughs> Road ahead closed. Bollocks. Don't believe it. <laughs> we just drop off a cliff. <laughs> Don't they know who I am? They can't close a road from me. <laughs> Chipping Camden. Yes, that's where we want to go. Hooray. So the reason we're going to Coty Auto Tally if that's what it says, is uh, it's where Dave goes. He used to be called R19 Dave, now he's called R18 Dave. And why is that? I'll let you work out why that, uh, why he's called R18 Dave. Um, he's now announced it on uh, Instagram, so it's not a secret anymore. Right, we're turning left in 0.4 of a mile, sort of that sort of left. That direction, that direction as in left. <laughs> that way, yes, left. <laughs> I said left, didn't I? You did, you just went, we're going left, that way. <laughs> yeah, if I, I do know. <laughs> well, I don't know if you know. You are riding a sports bike after all. <laughs> it's a straight road there, Bigglesworth. Do you want to do it? Right, oh, God's truth. Ready? <laughs> right, three two, one, go. <laughs> Very similar. I was a bit late on the uptake. Uh, and then I, and then, thank you. And then I kept with you. So very yeah. similar. I kept on hitting the limiter though. <laughs> then I caught you up a little bit and then it was all very same. Yeah, I kept, I kept on hitting the limiter. Okay. Oh wait, oh I've hit the limiter again, it's change up gear. That would have been a better launch. <laughs> it's around here somewhere. Hooray. Right, stop it recording. Bye bye everybody, we made it. Bye. Right. Are you going? Tally ho! Tally bally ho indeed! Right, we uh, just popped into Coty Auto Tally, which is a very, very nice new moto I cafe. really like that, that was a really good place. At Shipping, at Chipping Camden. Very good coffee, very, very good toasties. Probably the best ham and cheese toasty, would you say? Uh, it, was, it, was, it was up there. Yeah, it's up there. The cheese was delicious and melty and yummy and exactly how it should be. It was the perfect sort of comfort food wasn't it the, the, the cheese was spot on that was a really nice cheese that was the that was the defining factor i feel <laughs> but really it was just a nice atmosphere very nice atmosphere very chatty bumped into a couple of nice chaps who actually spotted me <laughs> uh sorry us sorry bigglesworth us no 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 it's 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 more about the rambunctious i don't have my old channel it is all about the rambunctious bottom did i say bottom sorry i, I meant channel uh, uh. Although, of course, I was spotted down in um, West Sussex. You were because of me, though. Yeah, the Talk Cafe. <laughs> and a lovely gentleman came up and said, Are you Bigglesworth? As in Bigglesworth and Captain Rambunctious. Yes. Yeah. <gasps> it's great. <laughs> <laughs> and you wound up a friend of ours who's got a really big Instagram account and you were more famous than him. <laughs> <laughs> At least I didn't say his name, did I, Chris Barber? I mean, oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> You mustn't say Chris Barber's name. Stop it. Who's Chris Barber? Don't say Chris. Oh, Van. Van, Van, Van. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> oh, yeah. How much fucking fun is this? <laughs> Sorry, fun. It's not fucking fun. Fucking fun is something totally different. Oh, <laughs> well, this is a good road, isn't it? Oh, yeah, I, was, I was just about to say that. This is a really good little road, this one, isn't it? Bit of a junction, though. It's blind on the right. Careful. All right. Oh, <laughs> oh, fuck, it's all fun until someone dies. <laughs> the plough in, <laughs> I'd rather. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, my dear, have you got a furrow I could plough? I'm feeling in a harvesting mood. <laughs> <laughs> It's all the talk. It's all, all the about the talk. Hey! It's just the sound of it. It's just constant noise. What I love is the fact that this 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 bike sounds fantastic and it seems really loud in isolation. But all I can hear is your bike right now. Really? Yeah, I can barely hear mine at all. <laughs> Good, isn't it? <laughs> no, I, I need, uh, I definitely say heated grips. The trouble is, these grips are lovely. Yeah. With, um, because they're the barrel grips. Oh, yeah. So when you're wearing thick gloves, the barrel grips are really comfy because you're, you're not having to hold something that's too thin. I'm used to holding something thicker. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so the oh trouble dear. is, the trouble is yeah. the heated grips. Strangely, the heated grips are actually thinner than these barrel grips. Right. So, and I don't really want to go for something thinner. Um, but you, you want, you need something thick and hot, do you? Yeah, right, basically okay. meaty, <laughs> chunky. <laughs> And, and full of heat. Right, okay. Uh, uh, nice and okay. warm. <laughs> Hot and, and as, I mean, because also when it's, when it's, when it's thicker, you don't feel it throbbing so much. Oh, God. <laughs> 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 oh, I've missed our little rides. <laughs> anyway, filtering, filtering, filtering along, filtering, filtering, this is my filtering song. It's been a while since I did that. Let's go. Oh, I thought you were going. <laughs> All I saw was you accelerating very close towards me and then jumping on the brakes. <laughs> I was like, accelerate, accelerate. No, he's not accelerating. Normally he'd be accelerating at this point. Normally, normally he would have been passed about four cars by then. They're going at quite a good lick. Yeah. Oh, dear. I can't hear you say a sentence like that without thinking, God, you're going to say something else about licking, aren't you? <laughs> I wouldn't lick a German unless he was glazed in honey. <laughs> that reminds me, I was debugging champion of 1993. Oh, dear. <laughs> I was also the Mooney master for at least one year of the Mooney Brigade. What? We had a Mooney Brigade at school. <laughs> <laughs> you went to a very different school to me. <laughs> I'd managed to work my way up the echelons of the crack, <laughs> sliding my way further and further higher until I finally made master of the Mooney Brigade. <laughs> <laughs> I hope I'm still recording. I am! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh. Anyway, what do you think of the Stratford Banbury Road? It's quite good, isn't it? It is. It's much better than the M40, isn't it? Yeah. It even has some corners. Speaking of which... <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. <laughs> Tightening radius. <laughs> that was unexpected. <laughs> Bambury 6, 
petrol station. Range 11. <laughs> bit of mud, sir, bit of mud. It is dry mud. I'm going to hit the centre, I think. Yep, me too. It's well, that is a lot of mud. What that is a hell? lot of mud. Uh, I'm going to go there. That's where I'm... Uh, uh, I reckon uh, there's I'm good. Gonna... I think this is the best bit. About there. Just a little bit to the left. Oh, yeah. Oh, just a bit. Oh, yeah. Just a little bit to the left. That feel good. You like that, ah. do you? Oh. Oh. Oh, there we are. Lovely. I've got to say, this has been a really, really good day's ride. It's been quite fun, hasn't it? It's been awesome. Well, we do hope that you've enjoyed another another thrilling episode of Rambunctious and Bigglesworth Talk Shit. Yes. Uh, and it's Tally Bally Ho from me. And goodbye from me. Oh, you boring bastard. Right. Tally Bally Ho. Bye. <laughs> bye. I don't know what that was. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs> goodbye. Farewell. Auf Wiedersehen till you buy. Goodbye. Goodbye. Fata fata. Fata fata. See, that would be lovely if you'd used the right tune. And then we'll be You're still indicating right, by the way. Oh, for fuck's sake. Get a nail in the tyre on that bit of gravel. Hopefully not. <laughs> we've had our fair share of those, haven't we, over the years? Oh, we've had our fair share. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Can't move for all the nails we're getting our tyre. Oh, no. No, they just sit there, don't they? They just sit there waiting for one of us to come along and run over it and penetrate our rubber. Ride along and all of a sudden a little nail goes, hello you bastard. And then Get penetrates our you, rubber. Give you a puncture. And the little Before we know it, it, we're pregnant. <laughs> You're pregnant, did you say? Yeah, I was talking about the nail penetrating the rubber. Oh, I see. Oh, right, I gotcha. You see what I mean? And it, well, That's what happens if you penetrate your rubber, you're, you're fucked, mate. Oh, what, what, proper fucked? Proper fucked. <laughs>